Hey everybody, Ben here. We bring you a launch TDM. Uh, get a pretty decent score. I'm not entirely sure what it is. I think it's uh, I don't know. It's I don't think it's quite a 10 KD. Something like that. Um, pretty much launch. There's two different spawns. Well, there's more than two different spawns, obviously, but there's two main spawns where we spawn, where the enemy spawned just now. They'll basically switch between those throughout this entire match and most matches, really. Um, yeah, even in headquarters and domination. What these two guys are doing, don't do that. Um, this guy literally just went prone and sat there, uh, not moving for a long, long period of time. And I just basically came back and just shot him in the face. So, basically, probably tip one just for this video is keep moving, never stop. A stationary target is so easy to hit. If you're moving, at least, like, the bullet detection, it just, it won't work quite as well, so... Always keep moving, don't just sit in one place. Right here, this guy, I'm just kind of hip-firing him. I know he's coming up because of the UAV, and he's just running blindly around the corner. Uh, another thing, well, this is the exact same idea. Move, he just sits in the exact same spot while I fire away at the exact same spot. Um, they are spawning back and forth, back and forth, and I'm just controlling this area. I guess you could call it camping, but... I don't know, it's a very defensive play. It's how you're supposed to be playing TDM anyway, so... If you don't want to play it correctly, then you're going to get killed, so... It's not even camping, it's not as if I'm sitting in a corner or anything. But, yeah, they keep switching back and forth, back and forth, running back and forth from the top here. I have a really good vantage point from the top of these, uh... catwalks, so... My team is an MG is showing the barrel. Anyway... They are running out. I am, this is one thing. Pick your shots. Um, that was really an incorrect decision by me. I kind of gave away my position really quickly there. Uh, right here, I am out of ammo, so <laughs> managed to pick him off with my pistol. But back to the. Uh, oh, I forgot what I was talking about. My fault. <laughs> Oh, so here, I just kind of pre aim the doorway. Because of the Blackbird, I kind of... I know he's coming up here, so I'm just going to wait for him. There's no reason for me to go over to him, especially because I know exactly where he's looking and where he's going. I don't know if anybody else feels like this, but whenever I have a Blackbird up, I feel like I'm kind of cheating. I feel like... I don't know. I, I'm breaking the rules. I have hacks. I, uh... Just, it's, it's just not right. It just doesn't feel right. But I'll take what I can get, get I guess, so... I keep running out of ammo, so I have to go pick up this guy's scavenger pack. Uh, just hip fire this guy right here. Plus, I don't think I was actually expecting to get that kill. I don't usually have a great connection and kill people that quickly. Uh, these guys, they really. One thing you should be looking always look at the spots they were in before. Uh, usually they'll be smart enough to move around, but in this case, <laughs> I wasn't, so. I'd get a pretty good score regardless, so. The rocket goes off. I hate that thing, especially in headquarters. Why would you put a headquarters there when the stupid rocket's about to go off? Oh, I'm catching the headquarters. Oh my god, we're doing so good. Boom, you're dead. Why? It's, it's just one of those things that just annoy me the hell out of me about this game. Uh, just picking these guys off. Yeah, this guy's prone on the ground and manages to pick me off. Eh, whatever. There's just some really clueless players out there. Like, I think the number one thing, if you want to improve your game, I, I think not just playing a lot. Like, playing a lot does help. Playing with the right weapons definitely helps. And playing with an attitude to actually improve is another thing. Like, um, I think I talked about this before, but, like, running around with tomahawks, running around with a sniper rifle, running around with a crossbow, like, they're not real weapons. They're kind of novelty items. They're just there for really fun. And, I, like, people do play this game. I understand people just get on here for a couple hours a week. Like, it's not a big deal. They just have fun. They screw around. They may get absolutely owned in some cases, but they're just here for fun. And that's the point. And I do understand that. I'm I'm a gamer that just enjoys killing people. Enjoy winning. Like, I like it when I get these big scores. I like it whenever I just absolutely wreck the entire enemy team. It, it makes me feel good inside. It gives me that little uh, warm, tingly feeling. So, I don't know. It's, it, different perspectives on playing the game and what you kind of strive for. But if you want to get better, if you want to stop getting killed, definitely uh, play a lot. Play with a serious intent. Um, 
another thing. People should be... Like, watching YouTube is actually a really good way of looking at Like, I probably got in a lot of my... At least how I play, anyway. Off of YouTube and just... Yeah. Just different commentators and stuff. But, uh, I'm not entirely sure what my score was. Our, our team beat them pretty badly. 20-2. So I did get 10.0 KD. Uh, thanks, guys. Bye.